Here we go, people. I got 38 seconds. It was a hard one to get set up quick. Nathan Garrett here. Live racer focus. We got DS Dave. And Dave's going to carry me through. It's all on him pretty much for the broadcast. Dave, 20 seconds. Let's uh, jump right into it. Okay, I'd like you to focus, Nathan. Here we go. It's going to be critical. This is going to be 39 kilometers. I've got one rider in this race. That's Nathan Guerra. He's racing out of Wisconsin uh, for the Vision team. This is USA Cycling oh, we're League. We're Broken Spoke uh, now. Broken Spoke. Oh, Broken, broken spoke. spoke. I'm sorry, Nathan. I'm sorry. So, okay, oh, well, good. We got that sorted out early, so here we go. All right, it's always hard early. Nathan knows the drill here. Let's just settle in. Find your rhythm, buddy. Find your rhythm. So, all right, let us let me introduce myself and Nathan. I've already got his team wrong, but Nathan and I are <laughs> colleagues. We do, we do a lot of commentary throughout the week uh, on Zwift Community Live. Nathan is the founder, owner, and uh, the, uh, the voice of Zwift. It's so fun being up along for this ride. So uh, my name is Dave Toll. I've done a lot of in real life announcing stuff like the Amgen Tour of California. I've done every stage of 14 years of that race. But more importantly, Nathan and I, I've had a blast. I've uh, kind of joined up a few months ago, and I have done a tiny amount of work with teams through the years. Uh, it goes back to more than about 20 years ago, actually, but uh, some things don't change. Athletes and the way races play out, uh, the story of the race, the timeline is going to be the same. So good, Nathan. You're looking good right now. We're gonna, Nathan's going to oh, be boy. controlling the, the perspective. Yeah, they go out so hard. We'll be watching these numbers here. But so, again, Dave Toll here. We we will check in with Nathan. Nathan, you're positioned pretty well right now. How you feeling, buddy? Pretty good. I got to bring it back now. It's gonna be tough to talk. Okay, a don't talk bit. too much. Yep. We're okay, okay though. We're okay. Yeah. Right, Fifty three, not so, too bad. But that was a I kick for sure. Yeah, Ooh. they go out so hard. What a surge. So, okay, Nathan, I will be very respectful here. If Nathan takes this seriously, we're going to have a lot of fun tonight. But the problem is, if I make him talk, it really is a, <laughs> it's not a, it's not a great situation at some point. Now, obviously, the first part of the race is very hard. Nathan didn't have a chance to warm up. We uh, There was some kind of pizza issue going on at the house with uh, the kids. <laughs> and, I don't know. Pizza issue. I love yeah. it. There was. Second. There was. We had to make sure the kids were fed. And there was a pizza on the way. So classic dirt situation. Dad inside riding trainer. The pizza's on the way, and we're on the bike. So we're good to go as far as that goes. Woo. Well, I was joking, uh, Nathan. Uh, when you start playing the introduction music on Zwift Community Live, I'm like Pavlov's dog. I can feel my heart rate. If I had a heart rate monitor on, I bet it goes up 10 beats right when the music starts. So for your kids, once they know that the pizza is coming, uh, you're in a much better place here to get some dirt time. So, okay. So Nathan, right now, first couple of kilometers, Nathan, it might settle down a little. I, I was looking here. You know that Kieran Lewis is in this race, the Australian. He's super strong. Caleb Carl, Edwin Park. Joel Carroll. So there's a lot of strong guys here. We did this race earlier today. It was a Donnie Brook. And so Nathan's going to be aware this 39 kilometers goes by pretty quickly out here. It's a lot of the gameplay that goes into Zwift uh, comes into play here. So, okay, Nathan, if you want to chime in, I'm going to let you, but it looks like these guys are, you know, going to keep the pressure on here. A lot of Americans. Wheels. Just racing. following wheels now. I'm just yeah, good. making sure That's nothing gets away. Stay to the front. You can see I use a very different view than most. Um, hey. I try and make sure that whenever a wheel is going forward here, I'm kind of grabbing it without too much effort, but never sticking my nose in the wind. So as you can see- hey Nathan, show me the wrong view. Show me the wrong view, because we've talked about this a lot over the last couple of weeks. So what happens, what Nathan's talking about is when you use this view, it's hard to time it when you're trying to make a catch. Nathan, I'll let you go back to the right view. Thank you so much for doing that, though. This, this already, I'm enjoying What about this wrong view? Like, so, some people get used to it. Sure, I just think sure. this is so much easier to gauge, because you don't have wind. You don't have depth perception in the same way. See how my depth perception Right here, I see 100%. orange going by, boom. I can try and grab jerseys going by, and I don't overstep them. Ooh. I should have said alternate view. You're right. 
So, okay, good. I like what you're doing, Nathan. Just stay in the sweet spot here. It's a bit of a washing machine there. They're churning constantly. You can see the guys coming around, Nathan, here. Just needs to hold position. I, I, I don't think that we're going to be too worried about any kind of attack. So, Nathan, one thing I always like to do as a director is to instill confidence in my riders. you got to let them know you believe in them. And I do believe in you. I think you're going to win. I actually have a really – I've got money on you, dude. So, uh, but, but one thing you – Can no, I start you pouring out the that. excuses? Can I start pouring out those classic cycling excuses? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> yeah, isn't that great? He, uh, your shoe buckle just blew up or uh, the, the well, 60 cat miles got yesterday diarrhea. yesterday on the Slugfest with guys who won the Tour of America's Dairyland. So that was a hard ride right. yesterday. Good openers. I feel in. good, though. I feel really good. I love it. So, so I actually think that uh, – so Nathan actually does uh, – where he is in Wisconsin, uh, there's a really strong local community, and it sounds like they're starting to reorganize some group rides. I want you – as a director, Nathan, I will talk later, but I want you to keep doing those rides. It keeps you really uh, – the edge sharp for you. So we're going to watch the laps go by. They're about two kilometers each, just a hair under. Uh, that's going to be critical point of the course here, Nathan. So as we watch this, we, we've already watched this course been raced on quite a bit. This is Grit City. Uh, we talked about the engineers, uh, the game makers, the guys who do, and women who do such an amazing job have created a really realistic simulation of crit racing here. So, okay, everything's cool. Nathan, as a matter of fact, uh, this is where the game playing goes on. I don't see any one team that has an exceptional number of riders. The Kate Courtney Fan Club has a couple guys out here, though. James Pham Racing. Uh, I love Kate Courtney. She's going to be an American Olympian. Pazzi's going off the front. Mark. I've been watching Pazzi, okay. Team Experimental. Let He's it. a very experienced rider. Very experienced. Nathan, let's give a couple little bit of leash, right? Are you going to bring this back? No, but no, let's no, just no, sit no. It'll come front. back. It'll yep. come back. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Yep. So let the other guys do some work. There's Jay Pham I was talking about, the Kate Courtney. Uh, obviously, we don't need to have the alarm bells ringing. Actually, if he's a strong guy, Nathan, we like this. This is what I'd want you to know. We <laughs> like it because let him burn a little bit of the wick down there. As There's going to be a guy we don't want to have to deal with later, right? Yeah, yeah. We've gone to the line many times in the series so far with him. Many times. You're, not, you're, you're sounding great now. Hey, did you hear James Lalonde was saying that uh, uh, he likes your chances today, too? James joined Oh, really? James, is James, yeah, James yeah. Is saying that? Oh, gosh. Yeah, yeah. The pressure is on. <laughs> yeah. oh. There's a lot of support from your Swift friends in the Swift community, but so do these other riders out here, Nathan. So we're going to be watching for guys that uh, clearly, i got to figure out who this guy in the yellow jersey is here because he looks super strong just staying right up in the sweet yeah, spot. The right finesse where I like boys. You to be. So the Finesse boys have been here every week, and they've been That's showing Caleb up. Carl. That's Caleb been, Carl. Yeah, 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 yeah. And he, they've yep. been showing up with like a full Watch team him. and sh chasing down. Attacking like crazy, they've really been a force to deal with. Okay, well, we definitely identify them as danger guys, Nathan. You know what Ooh. you're doing, that's for sure. Uh, uh, right now, as we come up on about three laps in here, uh, the situation is absolutely long perfect. It's a yeah, long it race, is. Dave. Ooh. Yeah, uh, without a doubt, you got to find that rhythm, and I think you are those looking good, sounding good, Nathan. And uh, we. Uh, watched a big group stay together. What what we saw was a, maybe eh, I'm going to say a, a field of 20 riders larger, 30 riders larger earlier today. And almost everybody made it to the sprint. So for with a lot of confidence here, uh, we talked about. And Nathan is more aware of this than anyone how hard it is for a solo breakaway to stay away, even a small group of riders to stay away. So. Oh, Nathan, I'm happy to see you where you are. We're good. Just uh, keep that powder dry. Let's see if I can there. move us around a little bit so we're not in the way so much with our video here. Hey, while well, it's Boom. chill, Nathan, well, and you can chill. actually talk, yeah. you, you amaze me. Have you ever done any of the Tour of America's Dairyland crits in your home state of Wisconsin? I know I, you're about uh, I was going to do them this year, actually. I was actually going to do them this year. Oh, but, um, man. Well, well, but, you know, got canceled. So. We'll get you out there next year. Yeah, for sure. I was All excited right. to do them with hey. the Broken Spoke boys. Would have been cool, but. Broken Spoke is a bike shop, isn't it? Um, Out of Green uh, Bay. Yep, Green Bay. Yeah. Love Wisconsin. So right now, Nathan's really slotted himself right up in the front. That's about as attentive as you could be. <laughs> and uh, yeah. All right. So I really want to go. Like it feels so slow. Like, but it. the reality is, it. is that. The reality is, is they're all waiting too. 
You're feeling good? There, anybody else who's strong is feeling good too. Remember when we were talking about that earlier today, Nathan? I was saying, hey, if you feel like you're feeling the best you felt in a long time and you want to attack, remember there's 20 other guys that feel the same way, right? All you're going to do is poke the bear. And we don't want to poke the bear right now. Let's just keep it chill. No Jarvis on my tail. No, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So one of the great things about crit racing when you have a team <laughs> is uh, the ability to have guys assigned roles. Nathan is racing, racing alone out here, but uh, I wouldn't be too surprised if we see some teams. Nice to see the guys from Thailand out here. Um, so it is mostly this time zone here, because right now in the mountain time zone where I am, or Nathan's in the central time zone, it's just uh, after dinner time or, or you know early evening here. So anybody who's joining us uh, from around the world, that's always very cool to see. Lloyd did Jones, pre, Did you have a pre raced meal? You have a pre raced meal, Dave? Did you get ready? Well, you know the most important thing when you're going to be in the team car is making sure you go to the bathroom <laughs> before you leave. <laughs> and also, also very important. So I used to do the Philly race, Nathan. We would be in the car for seven hours. Uh, uh, don't drink any coffee or anything in the morning. You literally okay. that night oh, be before rough. you stop be so, so you rough. have to go in you you go in under hydrated right functional dehydration it doesn't work on the bike but it does work <laughs> as a director <laughs> um, hey are you where doing have you directed where have you directed um, at gila actually okay, uh, okay. back in the early 2000s um, and i did redlands as well so i did a bunch of the american stage races in the year 2001. Um, I, uh, but nathan did you take a drink? Because I would like you to drink again. I want you to I stay hydrated. It's, I'm hearing, yeah, is there a, a problem race. over at the Facebook stream? Is Facebook doing okay, everybody? Let me know, yeah, please. It looks okay for me. Okay, good. Whew. Okay, we'll get a drink. They're yeah, no, really everything seems here. okay. Things are yeah, pretty good. chill. That, uh, but, so you had a big ride yesterday, went out with the boys, and just guys took out the pain stick and started slamming each other with it, it sounds like. I actually but, had a junior uh, racer come up next to me. During the race, the ride, well, it was like a race. During the ride, we're about halfway through. He comes up and I'm wearing my Zwift green ride on. He goes, dude, what's your name? I'm Nathan. He's like, oh, you do the commentary stuff. Dude, oh, I, I race the bees, man. I was like, right on, <laughs> bud. Good job, man. The kid, me and, him, me and him come to the line, like the final stop ahead sign. And dude's right here in my sprint. Like, okay, bud. I go back, we take a right, cool down the pace. I think it's time to upgrade there, buddy. <laughs> it was a good little, it was a good, <laughs> it was good fun. It was good fun. You know, your enthusiasm for the junior riders, Nathan, we've had a few over the last few months that have uh, stood out for us during the events we do on Zwift Community Live. It's, it's awesome. It really is. I sure appreciate that. Zwift does a tremendous job of uh, getting kids onto, onto the platform. It's, it's really a very special time for Zwift here as we, uh, Nathan, take a look. This guy in blue here, that reminds me of my old Wahoo kit that I used to wear. And yeah, I'm Kellison wondering. is here still, which is cool to see. You know, guys, yeah. there's a lot of people streaming besides myself. We're also doing this as a pilot to kind of like, hey, how do we support all the streamers out there? How do we support those who are putting in the effort, getting setups like this? I'll give you guys an idea real quick too. Here's the Here's the behind the curtain Wizard of Oz a little bit. Oh, thanks. You know, yeah. So here's me on the Wahoo on my bike. I've got my cork set up, you know, with a real power meter set up here with the desk that goes up and down. There's a bunch of other people, fans here, you know, and <clears throat> there's a lot of other people who have setups like this that have set up Johnny Rocket from Finesse going off the front. He's streaming right now. Ryan Callison streaming. Look, Joel Carroll, same too. Like, so are Nathan, putting the effort in. The best really want to create like this, this environment. If you have awesome setups, you're putting the effort in. Uh oh, it's time to go. Stop you talking. Go ahead, stop yep, talking. Yep. Yeah, stop talking. Okay, so that's me directing Nathan now because we got a bit of a moment going on here. So this is why I had him positioned well. Like how I take credit for that? It wasn't me at all. But Nathan doing a really good job of sitting up near the front because this is a moment. These guys have gone ballistic. It's turning into a Donnybrook here, and we're only now about I know what that a, feels a little like. This thing we in. keep talking about the Donnybrook. 
Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, Nathan. Come on. Sit on these wheels here. Now let these guys do a lot of work here. Get up to the next guy. Get up there. Get up there. Get up there. Come on now. We're okay. We're okay. All right. I think we're using good. these guys, we're going to surf this back. Just surf it back now because this is going to be uh, a split. It's probably happening behind Nathan, to tell you the truth. I'm going to guess that a few guys are going to get their tickets punched here. We'll do some uh, damage control in a moment, or I should say inventory. And oh, thanks, Nathan. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a little bit of a split. Off. There is. Yeah. There is. Yeah, I thought so. So, all right, come on. Focus now. Get up there. Up, 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 up. All right. All right. This is worst music for this moment because I want Nathan hyper motivated. <laughs> you, <right> wanna... <laughs> yeah. you must be a change of music. Nathan? Absolutely... Change of music, Nathan. Oh, yeah. Okay. No, I'm just kidding, Nathan. But I would uh, I appreciate that if you stay here or move forward, not too much, but just kind of creep up. Just try to use your. Good power, good power here. So this is where we don't like to have too many peaks and valleys in the in the profile when we look at the race later. On the uh, you, you'd like to see more flat lined effort, and that's where sitting up near the front of the group gives you a little bit of wiggle room, a buffer, so that when they make these surges and you know that they will come on. Now this is Zwift racing. These guys go out hard. They surge really, really hard, and the finale is unlike anything in sport. So, okay, Nathan, everything looks cool now. Let's see if you can get some deep that? breaths in. That was really well done and good bet on the music. Good job. Good job. <laughs> I like the tempo. Okay, nice work there. Shout out to Jerry for the situation. ride on. ODZ in the house. Appreciate it, Jerry Delport. Long time viewer. Good to see you, bud. This has been fun. And, you know, I want to give a shout out to Carissa, a man, um, uh, Bram. A man. Oh, She's a down. super cool person. <laughs> <laughs> so, okay, you're really well positioned right now. If you can hold on to this for a couple laps, I would love it. Yeah, they brought him back. They brought him back. We're all together again. We're all together. There's Dr. Weevils so that's versatilized. He's a streamer as well. Appreciate the ride on, bud. So, Nathan, out. good. Well, we can... Well, you can take a breath here. My question for you is you mentioned uh, at least a dozen of these guys are streaming themselves. Do I go to Twitch? Is that the, is that really the platform? Twitch.com. Where... You head on over there. Um, lot, so there's some differentiation. Game discovery is much easier on Twitch because they just have set it up where it really helps the game get discovered through how many people are streaming the game. Whereas... It's a little more myopic, centered on one person who has a following, maybe on YouTube or Facebook. Um, whereas the game itself, the more people who are playing it, the more people get discovered with it easier um, by streaming in one yep. place. So, good. Okay, I'm say, gonna let you breathe. I see a lot of people get discouraged because those who have a big following already on one platform, like YouTube or Facebook, have high concurrent viewers. Um, and then, they try on that platform and go, oh, that doesn't mean that. So um, if we all as a community come together on one platform, it's going to raise the game up for discoverability, and then new viewership comes in. So yeah, you yes, know, that, that makes, I would say go to that, the that, directory for Zwift on Twitch and see who's streaming. A lot easier to find it there. Right. So I would have to say, uh, Nathan does a podcast, the Zwift cast with Simon Schofield. We're recording uh, tonight, 1 a.m. Are you? Woo! Wow, you are, man. You, you know what? James Brown would be proud of you. The hardest working man in show business. You're the hardest working man in sight, like Nathan. Um, that <laughs> oh, they're podcast, coming right on though, down. I don't know what happened here. Yeah, well, chill yourself then. We don't need an attack <laughs> from you right now. So settle down. So, what was the saying? The Irish saying, stall the beans. So, okay, but... This is where you can see how you back off the power for two, three seconds, and you are right back in the mix. It's amazing how these guys just are relentless out here. But we don't need to regulate anything right now. Nathan, great job. Make sure we're staying hydrated here. Uh, how hot is it in Wisconsin tonight? You guys oh, it was real wave? hot, but I got an AC in yeah. here at 60, and I got the big old fan oh, right yeah, here. Good. I mean, I got a good. huge fan next to me. Whew. Well, that's one of the things um, that we recognized very quickly was how staying cool makes such a big difference and your ability to even enjoy, uh, to be able to race. Uh, it is certainly, that's what it, the old pain cave. When I uh, started using the term pain cave, it was a hypothetical place, right? That you'd go to in your mind. 
Now it's an actual place. To, <laughs> like a she shed. All right. Okay, good focus, Nathan. I really like the way you're positioning here. Positivity, positivity. It was at the back I like for a also, moment. I got a little scared. I know. I know. You had to you had a little bit of work to do, but you did it. So good. We uh I like where you're at right now. Uh, it's the odds you know that okay, one rider attack. Let's figure out who this is. Uh, nothing might be to worry a left. about. I'm not sure. I can't tell. A good call. I think that is a lap rider, but either way, they're being lapped or they're coming back, so not a yeah, problem. Yeah. No problemo, senor. We got this. Um, I bet you get so many ride-ons. Uh, I'm lucky to get into the double digits after an hour of riding. You must see a lot of those blue thumbs coming down on you. Um, I love it. Every time I see one, it makes me feel good. So, all right, dude, I like where you're sitting here. Nice job. Um... How's your sprint these days? Uh, have you got a good kick going? We haven't well, really uh, discussed I hit, that. Um, I hit a pretty good um, two-year peak yesterday. I almost hit 1,300. But indoors, I can't push over 12, really. But Okay, good. We're going to edit that out because I know your competitors are listening. I'm going to edit that out <laughs> and bring it back and have you saying that you hit 1,800 like Mario <laughs> Cipollini. We're going to freak these guys out now. They... Uh, <laughs> These guys know you, Nathan, that's for sure. Um, and that's one of the things I like about Swift Power. You can go to swiftpower.com yourself and, and kind of get a feel for the, the power profiles of these guys. There's a lot of data that's collected along the way. But okay, Nathan, I guess the, the thing is, hopefully these guys aren't listening because I'm gonna ask you about how you're feeling. Do you want to attack this race late? Do you want to wait for the sprint or do you not want to talk about it because you know that they can hear you? I'm hoping Finesse keep doing what they're doing. Look at them, making it hard. I like it. I like it. This plays out. It's almost like you're part of their team. They're riding for you, buddy. Let them we'll do see. it. I mean, it's going to make things it. hard enough that it's going to whittle it down, which is nice. Hopefully some fall yeah, well, they off. Already, so, so, Nathan, there's been two moments where we've lost riders out of the group, right? There's going to be another one coming, so make sure you're positioned well. You're falling back a little more than I like. So there you go. There you go. Nice job. Because you know it's going to surge here, right? It is right now. Podsy's chasing. Yep. Okay, here, we go. here you go. Just focus. We'll let you. We'll, we'll let you race, and I'll take you through. This is the beauty of. I the want the speed to come you... up, though. I want to help it come Good. up and not be a part of the problem. Like... Okay, then take a pull. Go swap a couple pulls through. Then go ahead. I'm not I gonna like go it. all the way to the front, but I want to make it so I'm not a part of the bunch. And I'm in well, the these stream. These guys are gonna blow it up, Nathan. <laughs> I, I have a feeling behind you. So. Again, I want you to focus on the race. You don't have to talk right now because it's going to get tough here. Nathan Guerra moving up. Our man. That's our boy. Great job, buddy. Great job. See, we got All a little right, gap. So yeah, they're gonna, There'll be a few that come right back, the, but it might snap it. We'll see. Okay, this is the USA Cycling. These races have been going on for the last, I think this is the ninth of ten? Nine, I nine should actually, yeah. Yep. So I'm so focused on directing, Nathan, I'm not thinking about the commentary anymore. It's a 39-kilometer race with 20 laps out here in Crit City. This is the world is whiffed. This was a, I don't know, Nathan, when did they make Crit City? It's not even a year old, or is it? No, it is about a year old. About that, maybe. No? Not even. Not even, yeah. So it's, I don't know the exact date, though. It's getting there. It, first birthday is probably pretty close, I would think. Um, but this course, though, is a really a tremendous simulation of the, the word virtual, uh, right? Uh, I've seen it used a lot of different ways recently, but it really means as good as or close to. Well, virtually, this quick course is exceptionally close to Halfway what through, racing on a little gel. Okay, yeah, yeah, there you go, midpoint. All right, let's do a quick check. How are you feeling? Take a drink for me. Nice. That hurt a little. That definitely hurt a little. We're okay. Yeah, it, it, it should have hurt the other guys, too. Always remember that, right? If it hurts you, it's hurting them more. We'd oh, like to think that way. I'm calm. We sure do. I'm not over or anything. Like, I'm not, like, you over see or anything, but... Well, I think this is about as calm. What's amazing, Nathan, is how you find your peace at about five watts per kilo, right? It's, a, it's really interesting how exercise is so, so good for the body and mind. As this is Nathan Garris' sweet spot right now. Actually, no, it's not. I'm moving up a little bit here. Is this group's a little smaller, Nathan, than it was earlier? And we nice job, buddy. Couple, nice job. Really came through. Hopefully, we can get some more pressure. But I really don't want to do the work. Well, you can't do it all yourself, and uh, you know we're gonna see. 
We're going to see what happens. Broken spoke writer here as we, I'm Dave Toll again, directing Nathan today. First time we've ever done this. It's been an absolute blast so far. Lots I'm giving Nathan. Here. I'm Get giving you four out of five stars as a director, <laughs> Nathan. <laughs> you know what? I would say if they if they ask me, hey, how's the director, Nathan? I'd say he's a renegade. He's a renegade. Well, no, I'm just kidding. The thing about Nathan is he knows more about this than anyone I know. So it's a little bit. Uh, we're obviously having fun with this format here, but Nathan doing a really good job. I mean, so I say Nathan's racing alone. So are most of these guys. There's not any tremendous. I mean, uh, Finesse has a good. Going on. Oh no! Finesse did I see Timmy Bauer? I th- hey, Timmy's Nathan, here. I think mem- Me and okay, Timmy so are I here. See- Let me show you something quick. So- yeah, Timmy Bauer is a big guy uh, in the sport. He's one of our favorites. He's out of Northern California, Placer. We, uh, so as far as Timmy goes, this. we're watching Timmy. We're watching oh, Timmy. So, so this, uh, let me run through this then. So, ahead, oh, yeah. I see what's going on. So Nathan Guerra is our series leader with 171 points. So every uh, morning or early afternoon, we announce a version of this race. Nathan's been racing each week, and you can see he's 171 points. Nathan, I didn't know you were leading the series. Nathan, <laughs> uh, really, that's keep so it cool. cool. So we're keeping it cool, Dave. <laughs> you're the best, dude. You are really a fun friend to have. Chad Butts sitting in second. Alex Tenzel, Alex Ten Elsoff there, and and then Timmy Bauer. We were talking about Timmy. He's well known. Blake Harper, Kieran Lewis from Australia. Joel Carroll's in seventh. Michael Prozeline, and uh, he's another rider. Nathan, we should talk about that. You'll obviously be watching. Don Stratton, and then Matt Usborne. That's your Dude, top Stratton. ten. Uh, oh my Matt gosh, Stratton! Native. If he's in the sprint, we're gonna have a tough day. That boy's on oh, the boy, track in Australia. So- Junior rider, so strong. I don't know that he is, sir. I think that we're, I'm going to try to do some more research, but I haven't seen him yet. But we definitely know that Bauer is a guy you're going to want to focus on. We're more than halfway in, everybody who's joining us. Thanks. Yeah, the comments are great, Nathan. I really appreciate everyone. Uh, And we're going, oh, Martin Carew is watching, Nathan. So Martin pulling for you out here. WTRL will be doing our broadcast tomorrow for the World Pack racing league which is by far my favorite hour of the week each and every week they're into you know over 60 editions of that team time trial eight riders start time taking off the fourth rider all right nathan i'm going to turn my attention though back to you because i like what you're doing here just kind of working in the group Uh, nothing to worry about here every time that these guys attack it brings the speed up a little bit how you feeling doing okay hurting a little bit we're okay heart rate's not responding the way i'd like but i think we'll be okay Doing a little some physiological Yesterday's ride with Nathan. Yesterday's ride, definitely yeah, there. Went a little too hard, mate. Or not too hard. It was a great ride. Uh, it's okay. But, no, it's a great ride. And this is mainly so be, uh, the idea where I need a base rebuild a little bit. I've taken a few eight to twelve hour weeks. Now we're looking toward Order Shore, uh, Schwamagon, and uh, Iceman. So uh-oh. hoping those will happen. And if they are happening. It's about time to reinvest in base. Um, we're leading the series, so I said, okay, we can maybe sacrifice a little fitness, hopefully still win the podium, but at the same time, we can go back to back to back a little bit more, get some big hours and push back to 20 plus hour weeks, and get some outdoor riding in. So that's the aim. That's why we rode yesterday at 60 with that slug fest. So John Saunders, Nathan, in the comments saying, the faster that you talk, the faster you pedal. So I'm going to let you call the sprint. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> let you call the sprint. That's going to be the finish line there, folks. So Nine um, to go. It's a, tr- it's a nine to go. Tricky finale for sure. These laps are right at 2K each. Just for people's information out there, you're getting a good look at Crit City or downtown Pain City, as I like to call it. One of my more overused <laughs> phrases. I think so. <laughs> we love them. Try to. We love them. Thanks, Nathan. Um, so, all right, everything looks good. I like seeing you taking a drink there, just keeping that topped off and staying comfortable. Uh, this is where we've made it through the first half of the race. You've done a great job. This, Nathan, is where you shine. No doubt. This is where uh, they're going to be keying off of you, buddy. We know I that. Had we know what... I think Bjorn had a dropout. Awesome, Brent. Too bad to see. Three seconds. He went to Hate nine. to see that. I think he's done. We'll see. We call oh, that. He might be coming okay. back. He might be coming back. 
Almost there. Come on, there Bjorn. he is. He is. Almost Bjorn. There. Good job, Bjorn. Up, up. All right. That's nice to see Nathan rooting for a fellow uh, a strong rider, actually, Bjorn there. We don't know what happened. It's some kind of a dropout. And it looks like, though, he's about to rejoin. Good time to have a dropout. You guys have gone a little harder than this previously. So, Bjorn, Nathan, I think he just rejoined the group here. He should be. The big master burn. Ooh. Yeah, it is. Not ideal. Not ideal, but uh, that's about uh, the state of the sport. You know, always, always adapting, always trying to figure out uh, how to make the most of the situation. And then when you can, sit back, lay back, and then get ready to pounce. How are you feeling? Good, good, good. 146, pulling it down. I'm, There's I'm Timmy right there. That I'm interested when I'm suffering, though, 160s. Usually my thrush is about 170s, so maybe fitness is coming around. Maybe oh, unresponsive. Good. We'll see once we really get into the business end of things. So, you know, we're way deep, deep into this series now. So this is the ninth of the 10 for USA Crit. So this is brought to you by Sarah's Post Closet. Nathan, I'm just gonna rattle on here for a moment, let you have a yeah, chance go, to take some deep. So do me a favor and breathe deep here. Get ready, because it's coming. There's gonna be another old school fury moment here. I think that's another lap rider, by the way, that we've got up ahead of you. That's not an attack. Yeah, I'm going to call that a lap rider, buddy, so don't worry about that. So, yeah, this uh, this form of racing criterium so sweet in America. It really is. So uh, I don't know if we're going to get to do any of these this year. Uh, I have seen recently some races being scheduled, but, uh, yeah, it's it's uh, that's beyond my pay grade, as they say. But uh, as Nathan says, talking about, uh, you know, he mentioned some events. Is I like what you're doing, Nathan. Good positioning. Uh, there's a, a whole series of these really cool, like Iceman Comet, and uh, the, a whole uh, these point-to-point -point endurance races, much like the cross-country ski races that are famous, Birken, Birkenbeiner, that kind of thing. That uh, it reminds you of what old-school mountain bike racing was like. So, those are some events to look forward to, and it may be a little more realistic that we get the whole uh, the cycling family back together in real life, but. Not gonna lie, I've had a great time out here on Swift, whether it's riding that's McGee. or watching. Finesse is actually off the front here. Oh, it is an attack. Okay, yeah, yeah that's McGee, yellow. McGee from Finesse. Uh, okay. They're throwing bones out, I think, to try and get people to chase. So that was another. I'm sorry for the bad info there. But, uh, you're fine. You're fine. Yeah, it we looks like everything. You need a Swift open on your right. On your right, we need a second. Right. <laughs> I, I, you know what? I'm getting there. We're getting there. Next thing you know, I'm going to have a room full of potatoes. <laughs> <laughs> That's our inside joke. That's what Nathan calls my computer. Hot potatoes. Actually, you you need hot potatoes, not the cold ones. Hot potatoes, right. Yeah. <laughs> I need you to be a hot potato, buddy, because it's going to be, uh, they're dialing it up right now. Got the black and decker out to put some screws down here. Okay, a lot of American flags. That's nice to see. I should have mentioned the pros closet. They're down in Boulder, Colorado, where they have a relationship with USA Cycling. In these very interesting times, so many people are getting bikes. Uh, Nathan, I walked by the Trek store by my house here. Uh, they're like, it looks like they are almost sold out of bikes in there. I mean, literally, there's empty spots because they have just been selling like crazy. Yeah, so I it's a good to problem buddy, to have. Uh, I talked to my buddy down the street over at um, in Pewaukee here owns a bike shop and he's like, I have nothing under a thousand dollars. Everybody just bought it's everything. Crazy. They come in and buy five bikes at a time. The whole family. Yeah, it's it's nuts. I mean it's a good problem to have. I hope these all these bikes continue to get used and loved and I think that they will. We're gonna see a major shift in how America relates to the bicycle and that's a great thing. So but I don't want to get into that, Nathan, as far as well I do want to get into that, but not right now because you're gonna finish that's right on two K per lap, isn't it? So all I right. Know, I think, right? No. Six. So uh, actually six, less no. than that now, uh, or excuse me, you are at 39. Da, 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 da. I have to go, I I'm think. I'm sorry, Nathan. No, 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 it's fine. Cause lap no, 14, seven 20. to go. I think it's seven to go. Is it? I'm going to look to the left here. Oh, You're we'll right. Figure it out. I'm going to go. Nice job. Okay, good. Yep. All right, so seven to go as we... And this is where a director should know. You should not have your ride. I'll talk about that a little bit, Nathan. You've got to take responsibility for trying to do the get out in front split. of these kind of questions for your riders. Your okay, well, it's stringing out. It is getting interesting now. Full 
gas, full gas, split there, Nathan. Just jump across, jump across. Big effort, big effort. Good job. All right, so that's how I'm lucky that Nathan is so strong that he can just move around at will out here right now. Look at this effort from our rider, Nathan Guerra, moving up through the group. Sniff of, uh, sniff of danger there. Now we're onto the back side of the course. But uh, we'll get a good look at the run in now. This is the last K to the finish that we're going to be watching. Well, I should say, uh, we, they'll be looking at six to go. Six laps of racing remaining. There's a little more vertical uh, up and down on this course. We said you're either going up, down, or turning here in Crit City. Really does help. Gives it that uh, nice crit feel. A little <laughs> bit of sting in the legs. How are your legs, buddy? Because we're there. Good. Business end is here. Good, good, good. They're starting to warm up. We're good. We're good. I like that little effort there. That was good. Yeah, look at the numbers there. You can see everybody sitting in the mid fours pretty much now. Watch per kilo. Oh, Scott uh, was off so the back, much... I think. He was at seven for a second there. <laughs> Not a good, yeah. <laughs> All right. So, again, to bring you up to speed, 39 kilometers. It's 20 laps. And really, we'll focus on laps here. Oh, right up there in the corner, 14 of 20. So, they're going to see six to go as we bring them through. Crit City, Nathan, is like a Mentos ad. It's impossible to tell what continent you're on here. There's no a distinguishing features. The little mini map features. in the upper right helps a little bit, hey? That, those red dots, you kind of see what's happening. Oh, no, what I'm saying is I don't know if I'm in North America or in Europe or in Australia. Oh, right? yeah, yeah, no, yeah, yeah. That's a good point. There's nothing... It, yeah, and I think that's the way they like it. That's why it's like a Mentos ad. You just have no idea where the heck you are. It's just a bunch of beautiful people. <laughs> a bunch of beautiful people enjoying the heck out of a beautiful day. Well, it sounds like Swift. All right, buddy. We are locked and loaded. Not a drill, Nathan. Not a drill. Series leader. You're the gold standard. I, we cannot afford to miss a step. But we know it's going to be a sprint. I mean, come on. I, I'm 99% sure, which means I'm wrong. So we better sure watch out. Perfectly. Yeah, that's it. You know better than anyone where you need to be. How many of these have you won so far? If you can even talk. Just one. I think just one. Okay. Keep Consistency. Hit. But I have ladies all and gentlemen. And birds, really. Pretty much. Yep. Well, there you have it. You know, there's been Tour de France is one where the rider never won a stage, right? It's all about consistency. It's not about nice to put your hands in the air too. It That's is. For Last sure. week was nice. Last week was nice. It was a hard fought one. Five, five to go. Five to go, buddy. Right where you want to be. <clears throat> it's interesting. Uh, th through this sector here, game noise uh, does a good job of making you feel like you're vibrating. It vibrates my ears. So we get a look now at uh, where Nathan is sitting in the group. It is all together now. So they've lassoed back in any of the earlier breaks. We got some guys to watch. You know, Timmy Bauer, he's got to be hungry. Oh, yeah. Timmy's uh, gonna Northern be California there. All about he's got to be. A, yeah, he's going to be all about it for sure. He's done a really good job, Nathan. Me and him have gone to the today. line almost every race he's in. It's been Is Timmy right? right there with me. Yep, like right there. Such a I've good I've always racer. said if, if you so ever get a chance cool, to. Though. He's like, he sure is. Sportsmanship from him. First thing I see in my messages, dude, amazing race. You are awesome. Boom, boom. The guy's awesome. Timmy's amazing. Remember, Nathan, my joke, but I, it's not a joke at all. Timmy Bauer would make the world's greatest neighbor. I mean, he is <laughs> the nicest guy. He's so trustworthy. And, like, I wish that he'd get into politics, you know? Like uh, someone like that, you can just trust. Does the right thing, Timmy. We love you, man. So good luck out there. I hope you, I hope you give Nathan. I we have a photo finish, Nathan, between you and Timmy. Out there. All right. So, actually, you know what? Let's be honest. If you're a director and you're not pulling for your rider, you're not doing a very good job. So, Nathan, I'm pulling for you. Let's let's uh, let's get that Timmy Bauer. He's a he's a fraud. He's a He's fraud, right Nathan. He's right there on the left. He's right there. Uh, yeah, the orange and blue. On the wheel. On the wheel. Yep. So, so 
So that's the Saris. Uh, so Indoor Cyclist is the name of this team. Uh, they, they found some great sponsors that became Saris, the pros closet. And Timmy is a awesome rider to support. So there we see Timmy, danger man extraordinaire. I should go back, Nathan, and jump in on some Kieran Lewis, Caleb Carl, Edwin Park. Is Kieran Joel still Carroll. in the race? Is he still here? I believe so. I 100% believe so. Let's okay, see if we okay. can find him, though. Um, so I'm chatting I away on the YouTube. So we'll see if you know, also around. good for, for uh, Fun Savith, Alex Fun Savith, the Thailand uh, based rider, the Thai rider. Um, okay, looking at, I don't see him, Nathan, to tell you the truth. I'm not seeing Karen Lewis anymore. Um, well, that leaves one but, spot in the sprint. Let's, 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 yeah, I'm going to confirm that. But, uh, yeah, it certainly doesn't make it any easier, actually, does it? Uh, yeah. But it's certainly uh, one less guy to worry about. Okay. All right, Nathan, a little bit of a surge. Let's watch this one. Let's see if we can get these guys. Use your Jedi mind tricks. Try to talk these guys into doing your work for you. They're going to. Ozzy. Ozzy going to the front. Good to see a lot of familiarity with the other riders out here. We gotta here. get some broken spokes boys in this Discord. So I can start communicating and telling people to chase things down now. Come on. Yeah, Nathan, <laughs> can, Daddy can use some help, right? Ah. All right, yeah, it's getting gritty. Here we go. They're grinding now, and obviously these guys are going to start. I have a feeling that Nathan is pretty marked out here, and that's the way it should be. Is the series leader wearing a virtual yellow jersey? And ladies and gentlemen, we're down to four to go, four to go. Nathan positioned super well right now. There's really been no threat up to this point. Uh, watching their uh, – nice to see you get experience points. That's good. You can really use those. So, all right, we uh, – Take a look at the front of this group here, Nathan. Another rider stretching his legs a little bit, but well, wow, you have Nobody twelve going. million, twelve million drops. Yeah, just a few. <laughs> wow. <laughs> All right, so this is where we really don't want to slide any for Nathan. Make a commitment here. Don't fall further than uh, twenty riders back in the group now. I know it's a lot of work, but it's a lot more work if you end up getting caught much deeper in the group than this. A nice job there, just sliding up. That's perfect, perfect job. You can see some of the other guys doing the same thing. There's Poza. That's a guy to watch, Nathan. You know, as well as anyone. All right, the ramp up begins right here, right now. It's about and two and a half laps. Yeah, yeah three. And a half. It's three and a half. 17. You gotta finish this one. And then it's 18, 19, 20. 18, 19, and 20. So three and a half laps of racing remaining here. Jonathan Pate! Later user. I did Jarvis laps with Pate. Thanks a lot, Jonathan. Is that Appreciate right? right on. So, yeah, yeah. Yeah, then I'll go back to probably 2014 when the, 15, they yeah. got Swift. Yeah, 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 2015. So, okay. Nathan, sounding good, looking good. You're there got this buddy okay so now again uh we, we talk about this is a nine race nine in a 10 race series so all the work that uh, has been done up to this point i think nathan's done himself proud tonight he should score some big points here up, let's Ed? get greedy lot, hayden appreciate the ride on hayden all right, yep, all the support coming in from around the world for our rider here tonight. I love the positivity, such a big part. So, I mean, it's it's not a direct connect. You can't say a happy rider is going to be a fast rider, but it makes a big difference to keep these guys motivated and stoked to feeling appreciated and encouraged. As we see the finish line again, that turn comes up so quickly before that line right three there. To three to go. Three to go, riders. All right, Nathan. Well done, my man. Well done. Well, you couldn't have had this play out any better than it has for you up till now. Your TSS is going to be as low as is possible. 
And I guess a lot of other guys you could say the same thing for here. This has been a relatively calm ride up to this point. Hey, they Matt Lawrence Stevens. Stevens. Matt Lawrence, they both hey, Lauren. Right on. Both of them did. They're the best. I'm such big fans of both of those human beings. The king and queen of Dallas and Lauren just named to the Olympic. You have a, an American Olympian and world championship team member giving you shout outs, Nathan. Right Thank you, Lauren. <laughs> Lauren just named to the Olympic long team a couple of days ago. Friend of the program, that's for sure. All right, well, you got her support, Nathan. That should give you wings. Like Channel your inner Lauren Stevens, dude. Lawrence Stevens like and Red Bull, same thing, right? Yeah, yeah, right. <laughs> Except for, uh, yeah, I, I'm a I'm a bigger fan of Lauren, actually. <laughs> as we, um, so, so no aftertaste as we uh, walk uh, our way to the front now, Nathan. Great job. As, well, so we're really thinking sprint. Our Australian friends at POA. I think it was uh, the one and only Tim Ballantyne, Nathan, had this line watching Nathan. He was racing against the Aussie boys down there about a month ago. And uh, as Nathan comes into the finish and wins the race, they said he looked like a chicken having breakfast in the sprint. His head was bobbing up and that down. That was a hard one. Oh, that's true. You didn't win, did you? I wasn't that, that chicken, at that point. That chicken having breakfast line really stuck with me as a classic from Tim Ballantyne. So, it was Tim, right? Nathan? Tim, is, yeah, Tim and uh, yeah, yeah. the boys down there, they, have, they got His some colleagues great are great. Absolutely. Yeah, Greg McDermott. Yeah, they really are. Great stuff. Yeah, that's part of our Zwift community family. Um, Nathan is involved in productions around the globe. Uh, he's going to be doing the Zwift cast later tonight. Maybe he'll even talk about our experience here. As Nathan, watch you focus now. This is it. Full heart. Clear eyes, hat off, hat off. All right. You know it's business time when Nathan Guerra takes off the hat. That's like when Lancelot puts on his armor. It's go time, ladies. Two to go here. So that's four kilometers. It's going to be about four and a half, uh, under five minutes until this one is done and dusted. Two laps at two kilometers each. So now you just don't want to give up position. No reason to overcook it. But you can't take your foot off the accelerator either here. It's, this is the feathering that Nathan is so good at. We talk about the the eight different views that you have when you're Zwifting and how this is the one that Nathan really likes. And he's done a good uh, earlier in the race. We had a chance to take a look at why. That's weird. All right. So <laughs> right, right, through. Little, so, right, right through him. Right, right where you want to be. All right, slicing and dicing now. About a lap, a little more than a lap and a half of racing remaining. Well, it's been fun tonight, everybody. It's going to get crazy here, go ballistic. So before we uh, get to that point, I do want to say thank you, everybody, for your comments and for joining us. Uh, Nathan, thank you for uh, having fun with this tonight. I'm not going to ask you to talk anymore. I'm, I know that uh, this is going to get really, really serious here. We're going to start ramping it up. We'll get that bell in a few, about another minute or so, sending them out on the last rande, the last lap here in Crit City. I'm going to be watching again. There's Timmy Bauer moving up. Always worth noting, whatever Timmy does, I like to mirror that kind of activity as he's a, he's a leader in this community, as we're going to be getting down to it now. The nuts and bolts are now giving way to the brass tacks. As Crit City's finest getting ready to clash. Perfect with the music. Perfect with the energy. This is what the Zwift community is all about. A big thank you to USA Cycling and these tough times ever since the COVID-19 uh, that we entered a whole new world. The good folks at Rob, uh, a bit led by Rob Demartini, the CEO at USA Cycling, are continuing to fight the good fight for cyclists out there. Uh, they're doing an amazing job of having us ready to launch as soon as racing begins out there in real life. All right, uh, motivated rider coming through. I love getting to say this. It's been a long time. We're down to one lap of racing remaining. Nathan, one to go, buddy. One to go. One to go. One to go. One to go. 
Lap 20 of 20, folks. This is what they call the business end. You know there's going to be attack, and there it goes. Nathan, keep your position here, obviously. Uh, so now it's nothing but forward. Nothing but forward as it looks like this one's going to blow up. You've got the perfect wheel, buddy. Perfect wheel. Sitting right on the orange and blue of Timmy Bauer. Timmy now looks like he's going to get some help as riders coming through. We're going to start trying to close in these gaps, trying to weld this thing back together. So this is, again, our ride with Nathan, our perspective coming out of Wisconsin. Wisconsin, Oconomowoc, Wisconsin. This is the pride of Wisco as Nathan Guerra now show the series leader sitting on 171 total points is trying to consolidate his lead here with one race remaining after we wrap up here tonight. So this is, again, a 10 race series. We're down to the nitty gritty this turn. Playing the game really well, Nathan. Good job sitting right up there in the sweet spot of this group and now we're down to it folks this is 1k to go so it's really going to be they could talk about the hour of power it's going to be the minute of power now so we're just going to go over 50 minutes of racing for this group this is going to be incredibly fun to watch nathan dig in now we are ready to go I like it because this sprint, you really want to use the speed of the group. Nathan is going to show us how it's done here. Up out of the saddle, he's flogging himself like a rented mule. And there's even a little more to give. You're going to need that top end here because that's where the races are won in the margins. We're down to it. Less than half a K to go. Remember, there's that turn right before the finish line. So that line comes up on you incredibly quickly. We've had 20 chances. There are 19 chances to recon this finish. And this is when it matters. And here we go. Here we go. Come on, Nathan. Great job. Great job. Great job. The turn. There's the line. It's yours. It's yours. It's yours. Kill it, Nathan. Kill it. Kill it. Kill it. Nathan Guerra for the win. Oh! We did it. <laughs> champ that was awesome so nathan's gonna throw up now we're gonna give him a, a moment here as okay that was so much fun how about that folks so that's how you walk it like you talk it nathan Guerra winning we'll get some results up for you nate we're gonna give nathan a minute are you kidding oh. me oh, so that was you guys look at my studio watch it huge difference tonight Huge difference. Look at this. Put a mat down. Put a <laughs> mat down. I probably pulled an extra 30, 50 to 100 watts. That wasn't moving. And shout out to Saris. Um, they've been telling me, get a mat down. This isn't a Saris mat, but regardless, shout out to what you need. Get a mat down, because the trainer not moving on me gave me that extra dig at the end, I felt like I was sprinting in real life way more there than usual. Wow. Like, that is so cool. Like, so, um, like, totally that's your you pro need a mat, tip. dude. Yeah, for a pro tip of the day, I might have not won that sprint without that mat down because I was able to pull over the top so much more. So much more. So good. Nathan, I wouldn't have thought of that in a million years. So shout out to Saris, and they're our hosts tonight as well. So that's a perfect dovetail into our thank you to them for their support of the Ooh. USA Cycling Series. Oh, that boy. was awesome. Great job, man. Um, really, one. really fun to watch tonight. So good. You got some more points. We'll go into next week with you, uh, as, you know, as the man to beat. One more race to go. Congratulations, Nathan. Well, Great job. I might have got the... We might have more races than that. I think we're 10, but I, I was seeing that they might well, have I think a couple it was extra. 10. Right, well, oh, good. Well, then see. I hope I'd they do. do if more. not, can, can we I'll just renew more? more? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I hope I'm wrong. That's the first oh, time today that I hope I'm wrong. So Nathan taking the win. Uh, so, wow. Sayuras Min Chu Fu Chong in second. Way to go. Edwin Park in Third, Caleb Carl for fourth, Ryan McGee in fifth, Chad Butt sixth, Timmy Bauer in seventh, John Heinlein the third and eighth, Johnny Rocket up there for ninth, and Pozza, Michael Pozzolini. All right, Bazzi. there you go, top ten.
Congratulations, Nathan. You are the gold standard, buddy. Hey, we're one for one with me as your director. One for one with the director, baby. Let's go. I love it. Absolutely love it. Guys, that was so much fun. You know, there's a lot it's more. Here's, here's one thing. It's one thing I'm definitely going to say is live streaming my racing has taken it to another level. Training, live streaming your training, you have a witness. Right, you've got a witness there, right, watching you, and you gotta, you gotta put on the show then. And it's like, all right, you said you're gonna do something, do it. You know what I mean? There's, there's something to that, especially with having somebody in the ear. I definitely want to see if this format. It's, a lot of people are saying they love the format, so maybe uh, part of all this is we kind of start doing some searching and see if we can bring in some more. Because it's not just the Nathan Garrett show. We want to show off the whole community and everything that they're up to out there, the efforts that are out there. Maybe some head-to-heads even. That would be pretty cool. DSs and DSs. Team car versus team car. Maybe some other ideas, you guys. So we're absolutely loving this. And Dave, thanks a lot for all the encouragement and everything you're doing, too. That was a ton of fun. Oh, that's an absolute blast, Nathan. Uh, guess what? We're going to be back at it in about 12 hours. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, and you have a podcast to record podcast. tonight. I can't, um, I can't tell you how much I appreciate you, Nathan. Uh, you really are a leader in our community, and it's awesome. So have a great rest of your night. And everybody, thanks for the comments tonight. I don't think I've had this much fun in quite a while. I hope we can do Time it again. Time for the pizza. I think the pizza's downstairs. Yeah. <laughs> the kids are already into it, I bet. Time for a cool down. Pizza time. Everybody have a good night. Nathan Garrett, Dave Toll here. DCL, if you haven't hit those follow buttons, do so. Twitch, Mixer, YouTube, Facebook, we're live all those places. We'll see you out on course, everybody. Right on. That was great. That was really fun.